Bu nefret ve mücadele etmekten çok yoruldum. Ağlama. Ben senin için bütün kavgalara girmeye hazırım. Yanımda ol yeter. Sen de benim hep yanımda kal olur mu? Hasan'ın ne yapacağından haberin var mıydı ana? Sizden bir şey isteyeceğim. Dilan için her şeyi yaparım. Hello my dear followers. Welcome to our channel. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel to be informed about new videos. While Dylan and Baron were sitting sadly in their beds, Dylan was so tired of this hatred and struggle. Baron hugs Dylan and replies, Don't cry, I'm ready to get into all the fights for you, just be with me. Looking into Dylan Baron's eyes, Will you always stay by my side? Says, Mr. Baron Kudret and Ms. Azda come together in the study room. Mr. Kudret, did you know what Hassan was going to do, mother? He asks angrily. Ms. Azade's face turns pale and she thinks about what to say. Dylan speaks on the phone quietly and secretly and says, I want to ask you something. While Ms. Sabiha is determined and says she will do anything for Dylan, Havan calls the police to report Savahir. Haven says on the phone that I want to make a report. Baron corners Dylan in the garden of the mansion and asks what does that mean? Saying. Dylan tries to explain this to Baron when they get into bed. I thought I had no other choice at that moment. Miss Sabiha calls Miss Hanife to her home and slaps her there. While she gets angry, what kind of a woman are you? Hanife looks on in surprise from the shock of this action. In the garden of the mansion, Dylan hugs Sabiha and cries. Mr. Siat comes to the mansion and says to Dylan, forgive her, my daughter, and they hug each other. Ms. Azade asks Baron and says I want this from you as a mother, and Baron looks at her angrily. And in the last scene, Dylan's extremely surprised eyes open wide. You can share your valuable opinions in the comments section. Don't forget to subscribe and turn on notifications for more videos. See you in the next video. Take care of yourself. Goodbye.